Hey, what's up guys? Kane here with XBLA fans, and I just wanted to talk about the most recent Smite patch that just hit on console, and that is 4.5. Now this added a cool new Celestial Voyage event, as well as, you know, the obvious normal other patch notes. Uh, we'll have those linked up on the website, and that will be up in the description, so if you're curious to find out what all got changed, that'll be there. Uh, one of the cool things we're doing with this, though, is we are going to be giving away a ton of Smite skins. So we've worked with the Smite team, and we will be giving out almost a thousand different codes for Celestial Isis and another thousand codes for Stargazer Anubis. So you'll be able to win those on our Gleam giveaway, which is linked in the description of this video, as well as during our stream tomorrow on twitch.tv slash fans, where we'll be playing Smite tomorrow night, and you guys will be able to hang out with us as we try to complete some of these Celestial Voyage hieroglyphs. And this should be a good time. I'm looking forward to it. Now, the Celestial Voyage comes with five new skins. There's Star Lancer, Star Tamer, Star Strike, Star Eater, and Star Scribe. So, you know, Anher, Bastet, Neath, Capri, and thought I'll get, a, uh, I'll get a skin. My personal favorite out of these, for whatever reason, is probably the Capri skin. I really do like how he's got that giant kind of like Stargate on his back. You know, definitely not Stargate skin. Uh, Star Lancer's also pretty tight, so there's some there's some cool stuff. I like that there's a decent bit of variety on um, just the different kind of you know uh, roles that these take up. Obviously, they're all Egyptian themed, which is pretty cool. So last year there were two other skins: Celestial Isis and Stargazer Anubis, and those are the ones we're going to be giving out. Um, there's also the bonus rewards you can get. So each time you buy one of these, you get a crafting point. And there's these little hieroglyphs that you can earn by doing just basic quests. So some of these are pretty simple and don't take a lot of effort. Like, I think one of them is just win one game of anything. Obviously, there's others that are a little more complex, like uh, get 40 kills and assists or get five objective kills as a team. Nothing too difficult in here. And some of these come with Enigma chest rolls and others will give you fantasy points or favor. And that's just kind of neat. And one of the cool things about these uh, bonus rewards over here is they kind of have their own little like riddle in a sense, where it's like you have to put the right hieroglyphs in there in the correct crafting sequence, as well as a crafting point to be able to kind of get the reward. So you'll be able to decide which one of these you actually want. You know, there's some cool stuff here. You can kind of sample the music. Uh, I, I very much like what they're doing. I think it's kind of creative. And I love that there's stuff you can get without even having to pay money. That's always super welcome. So, like, I'm looking forward to getting some of these Enigma chest rolls and seeing if I can get anything good out of them. But thank you guys so much for checking out this video. We will have more Smite content up uh, throughout the month. Please do check back um, for more Smite news, especially focused around console. So, really do appreciate you guys stopping by. Please do like and subscribe. It's kind of how we... Uh, know what videos resonate with you guys and looking forward to uh more smite stuff we will be streaming tomorrow again at uh probably 9 p.m on twitch.tv slash xbla fans looking forward to that and make sure you enter our uh giveaway for skins in the description uh later guys